Thanks for checking this video out. I have a pretty special guitar here. This is the RL600 from ESP's LTD. It is the signature model of Ropa Latvala, ex Children of Bodom, Synergy, and Stone. And aside from being uh, one of the most beautiful metal guitars that I think has ever been made, it is pretty special, and I wanted to just go over a couple of things that I, that in my opinion, make this really cool, and is uh, are the reason that it's now one of my favorite guitars. First of all, it's a random star with a 24 fret neck, uh, 25 and a half inch scale, and that in and of itself is pretty cool because it was engineered with the entire action shifted towards the headstock, so you can reach all 24 frets super easily. Um, so like I have a regular random star here that I built from Warmoth and if you slide your hand all the way up you cannot reach all 24 frets um, not to mention it's a bolt-on so you can't you're not really playing much past 21 anyways unless you're a much better guitarist than I am but this has a neck through joint and uh, everything is super easy to get to which is really cool another thing that makes it unique is the nut width this has a 43 millimeter nut, which is not standard on ESPs. That's pretty standard on Jackson guitars. And if you look at old photos and old footage of Ropa and Alexi, they're playing on Jacksons. And so I, I wonder if that's um, a hallmark that he brought over from Jackson, but I think that's pretty cool. And it's, in my opinion, easier to play. I'm not the most precise guitarist yet. Uh, so having a little extra space between the strings from that slightly wider nut, I think it makes it a little easier to get chords out and um, make less mistakes overall. And then as far as hardware goes, it came with an EMG H2, which is the pickup that Ropa uses. However, he uses a boost, an onboard gain boost on it. So what I did was I took the ABQ preamp out of the Alexi signature pickup and wired it behind the H2. So now it has a push-pull boost like any Alexi signature model, um, but it has the H2 pickup in it. And I think the H2 is a little, it's not quite as hot and it's got a little bit more bass in it than the Alexi and it's just, uh, kind of got its own character. I didn't really like the H2 that came in my Alexi model, so I swapped it out, but I don't know if it's being a chunkier body or what, but the H2 sounds really great in this. Uh, overall, the guitar shipped in pretty good condition. It's got signs of being played, uh, which is fine, because I'm gonna play the heck out of it, so I don't mind that somebody else has played it before me. That just means they you know, actually used it. Um, and some of the strap buttons have been moved, so there's little, some little glue spots, little paint spots where the strap buttons have been moved. Here's another one down here. And weirdly enough, there's a nail stuck in the body underneath the pick guard. Or not the pick guard, underneath the pickup ring. I have no idea how it got there. I can't get it out. It doesn't interfere with anything, but... I really wish this guitar could uh, talk and tell me uh, why there's a nail stuck in there, but it doesn't negatively impact the guitar. You can't see it. It still plays fine. And the, old, the only other thing I've done to it is I put a uh, one of the push-in arms that has the little 
rubber ring in there that tightens and you get a much tighter seal on your uh, Floyd arm. But otherwise, this is just how it is. So I've restrung it, I played it a little bit. And I think I'll uh, jam on a little bit just so you guys can hear the sounds. I'm hoping to make more videos with it with higher production value. Um, I'll put a little more effort into it. So I'm not gonna go super hard right now. I'm just gonna get some camera audio just to round out the video. But overall, this is my new favorite guitar and um, I'm just super lucky and really happy that I found one. So thanks uh, for checking this out. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you have any questions or comments, leave them below. And uh, here's just a little bit of jamming. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,